Hi guys, happy new year. Merry Christmas to everyone. I didn't, I wanted to send out a Christmas greeting, but I'm like, I've already been in, I've already been updating everybody about what's going on this year. So um, new year's, so Christmas is over. We had an awesome Christmas. I had the four kids uh, here and we had so much fun together. And New Year's is just around the corner. And so I wanted to talk about, um, I went to this week at church, this young teenage boy totally inspired me. High school student, um, he totally inspired me. He, he was asked to talk about goals he set. So at our church, we have a program for kids, um, youth and, and children that it's kind of a new program that they started last year. And it's all about goal setting and personal development. And so this kid, he had been challenged to set eight goals to um, achieve during the year. And his first goal, his first goal that he shared with us was about weightlifting. So he set a goal, he could, he could uh, bench press 120 pounds and he set a goal to be able to bench press 200. And he was like making progress and things were going okay. And then COVID hit. And he was like, now what? Like, do I just give up on my goal? Because like, I can't go to school and all the gyms are closed and I don't have a bench press machine at home and I only have like a 25 pound weight at home. And he didn't give up. This is the totally inspiring part. Like this young, I don't know, 16, 17 year old kid. He just decided, you know what? I've set this goal. Um, God can bless me to achieve this goal. And so he did. He just kept exercising, finding ways to be able to get stronger and throughout the year. And by the end of the year, now he can, he's reached his goal. And he, and he shared a couple other goals that he had reached as well. And it just, it just really inspired me. I've done a lot of goal setting over the years, but I feel like I've kind of fallen off the wagon. I don't know if you're like that as well. I, one thing that used to really help me is having an accountability partner to, uh, every week I would have to report my progress on my goals. So I would set goals and then each week I, we would get together and say, okay, did you, did you, um, achieve them or not? So I've done that different times over the years and I probably need to do it again because, um, uh, it's really effective. So one thing I wanted to talk about is I have these new investors and they have totally inspired me because they have set this goal to, give a million dollars and I'm like wow that's just such an amazing like heart-centered goal to be able to want to, to want to be able to give a million dollars um, of their own money to somebody charity like just in their life and that really inspired me I'm really excited to work with these amazing these amazing new investors and and other just beautiful people like that in my life so that inspired me I've set a goal my goal is for this year, my giving goal is I have this like, it's big for me, but I've set this $10,000 giving goal and maybe I'll get halfway there, but maybe, maybe I'll get all the way there. And I'm, I just wanted to put it out there because uh, I know sometimes that helps you achieve goals when you've got that accountability of other people who are, who are rooting for you. So I would love for you guys to share your goals, um, not just New Year's resolutions that you're going to forget about come January 3rd, like real goals that you're going to work towards and um, to make a difference in the world. So I'd love to hear you. I'd love to share. Thanks so much for keeping in touch and watching this video. I think you guys are awesome and uh, I wish you all the best. Take care. God bless.